يصلون على النبي يا ايها الذين امنوا صلوا عليه وسلموا تسليما اللهم صل على سيدنا ونبينا مولانا محمد وعلى ال سيدنا مولانا محمد واصحابه وبارك وسلم نحمده ونصلي ونسلم على رسوله الكريم اما بعد فاعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم يا ايها الذين امنوا تقوا الله وكونوا مع الصادقين صدق الله مولانا العظيم وبلغنا رسوله النبي الامين المكين الكريم ونحن على ذلك من الشاهدين والشاكرين الحمد لله رب العالمين خوف يا اعظم بمنه بي سرو ساما مدد قبلا دي مدد كعبا ايما مدد قادري يم نعرائي يا خوف يا اعظم ميزنم دمز شيخ احمد رضا خان خود بي عالم ميزنم سيدي يا مرشدي شاه مصطفى خان زنده باد مسلك سرکار اعلی اعلی حضرت زندہ باد یا الہی مسلک احمد رضا خان زندہ باد حفظ ناموں سے رسالت کا جو ذمہ دار ہے سیدی یا مرشدی شاہ مصطفیٰ خان زندہ باد حامل فیض رضاء مصطفیٰ امداد کن صلی اللہ علیہ نبی الامی و علیہ صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم صلاۃ و سلام علیہ کے سیدی یا سندی یا حبیبی یا طبیبی یا رسول اللہ صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم وعلى آلك وصحابك يا رحمة للعالمين All praises due to Almighty Allah The road and salams upon the most perfect, exalted and glorified of Allah's creation Sayyidina wa Mawlana Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam Peace, blessings and salutations upon the Anbiya Ikram, Ahl Bayt Athar Sahabah Ikram, Khulifa Rashidin, Tabayin, Tabay Tabayin, Aimma Mushtahidin, Awliya Ikamilin And all those who will follow the path until the last day we thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala through His infinite mercy and through the wasila of Rasul Akram Nuri Mujassam sallallahu alayhi wa sallam for affording us the opportunity to congregate for Salat al-Jum'ah and to prostrate in His most exalted court. Before continuing, let us direct our hearts, our minds and our thoughts towards the sacred Gumbad-e Khadra and in doing so, let us recite the Rudi Path collectively. Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina wa Nabiyyina ومولانا محمد طب القلوب ودوائها وعافية الأبدان وشفائها ونور الأبصار ووضيائها وآله وصحبه وبارك وسلم دائما عبادا As I walked in I intended to speak about something else but when I read the kalam I decided to speak about something else We are still in the month of Safar. Today is also a Mubarak day, 28th of Safar. It is the yawm e visal of Hadrat Sayyidina Imam Hassan Mujtaba, <coughs> radiyallahu ta'ala an. And it is also the Urs Rapa Quds of Hadrat Sayyidina Mujaddid al Fasani radiyallahu ta'ala an. Very Mubarak Allah through the wasila may He bless us. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala keep us in the shade of the pious. We are still in the month of uh, Safar. Tomorrow is the 29th of Safar. So please seek out the moon for the month of Rabi Nur Sharif. Rabi Awal Sharif. And we must make dua that to the barakat of the coming of the month of Maulud, may all the waba and bala of the dunya go away. Because when Rasul Pak sallallahu alayhi wa sallam came, then the darkness disappeared. When Aka Karim sallallahu alayhi wa sallam arrived, the darkness disappeared and the entire alam became nurun ala nur so if we keep yakin that by the coming of the maulud of rasul pak sallallahu alaihi wasallam all this waba and bala will be alleviated then allah taala blesses the servants based on their hope allah taala it is hadith rasul sallallahu alaihi wasallam that allah taala does not allow the hope of a believer to go bekar so we must all keep hope and yakin together mazboot yakin rakhe to inshallah allah taala's rahmat will descend and i have no doubt koi samjhe na samjhe whether we see it or not magar rasul e pak ki milad ka mahina shuru hote hi subhanallah shuru hote hi barkat e nazil hoti hai subhanallah the moment it starts barkat is going to descend subhanallah and every bala of the dunya because the biggest bala is shaitan and when rabi ul awal comes shaitan himself gets bechain and starts running so everything else will leave it will all leave in its due course by the will of allah but rabi ul awal will definitely bring barakat 
Like how we saw Ramadan brought barakat. How we saw Ramadan and Laylatul Qadr brought barakat. Bahad fark hua. But all is in the will of Allah. But we must have yakin. So just for you to understand. So the discussion is on the month of Safar. We are talking. And I was discussing over the last two weeks or three weeks. The personality of Imam Ahl Sunnat. Allah Hadrat Azimul Barakat. Asha Imam Muhammad Raza Khan Fazil Ibrilvi radiallahu anhu. And the reason we talk so much about Allah Hadrat is because he is Imam Ahle Sunnat. Because he is the Mujaddid of the century. Because he is the personality who attracted our hearts towards the love of Rasul Pak in this era in a most beautiful manner. That is why we say Dal di Qalb me Azmate Mustafa. Dal di Qalb me Azmate Mustafa Sayyidi Allah Hadrat be. Laat ko salam. Somebody turn around and ask once and now. Jahilo ka kam hai sabal karna bila zorurat. Some people, people ask for two reasons. One they ask to learn, one they ask just to make a din, to make a noise. Kyunke aur koi kam hai nahi. Says Dal di Qalb me Azmate Mustafa. Sayyidi Allah Hadrat Pelak wa Salam. You are saying that Allah Hadrat put the Azmat of Rasul Pak in our hearts, but the Azmat is in the hearts from before. Dal ka bhot semane, to put him, has many meanings. Simple to understand. That was already there, and it is already there. But when the Bad Mazhabs were trying to extinguish, then that Azmat Allah Hadrat revived. He revived. Because if you make that Aitaraz on Allah Hadrat, you have to make that Aitaraz on Rasul Pak. You have to make it on Khaja Gharib Nawaz. Then the other ayatra asks, Why you'll say Sayyidi Allah? Hadrat? Allah wasn't Sayyid. I said the first level child learning Arabic will tell you that Sayyidi what the meaning is. Sayyid means leader. And when you put the Yaw next to it, in front of it, with it, Sayyidi, my leader. I told you this so many times. Sayyiduna, our leader. Kitabuna, our book. Huh? Sayyiduna, our leader. Sayyidi, my leader. So, Sayyidi Bilal. Bilal Abshi is not Sayyid But he is Sayyid in the sense of a leader Not in Nasr But in the sense of a leader Hadrat Sayyidina Sultan Khaja Gharibu Nawaz Radiyallahu Murshid the Kamil His Murshid the Kamil Hadrat Khaja Osman Harwani Radiyallahu An Where was he Sayyid? Magar he is Sayyidi Magar he is Sayyidi He is our Imam Hazrat Abu Sayyid Mubarak Al Mahdumi Radiyallahu An The Murshid of Ghazipa But he is Sayyidi He is our Imam Hadrat Abu Bakr Siddiq is not from the Nasr of Rasul Ipaq Islam, but he is our Imam Sayyidi Abu Bakr Siddiq. When hey, Sayyiduna Abu Bakr Siddiq says, then no one has to say it. When Sayyiduna says, then no one has to say it. Sayyidi says, then when has to say it. When Sayyid has to say it. Allah is not the Sayyid, but Sayyid is the Shaan. He is the Tariq. But he is that personality who prays the Shaans of the Sayyid to such a maqam. Like that. And this is that Allah Hadrat who said about the Sayyids, Ki Ya Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, Tere nasle paak mein hai bacha bacha noor ka. Tere nasle paak mein hai bacha bacha noor ka. Tu hai aine noor, Tera sab gharana noor ka. Tu hai aine noor, Tera sab gharana noor ka. Allah Hadrat Adimul Barakat radiallahu alayhi wa sallam, That's why he's called Imam Ishq Mahabbat. That's why he's called Imam eh? Ishq Mahabbat, the Imam of true love and affection. The Imam of true and profound love, deep love. One is Ishq and one is Mahabbat, one is love and one is deep love. Allah Hadrat is the Imam of that. Do you know why? Not only was he Ashik, Jitne log Allah Hadrat se Nisbat rakhne lage, sab Ashik ban gaye. Why? Not only those who got Nisbat to Allah Hadrat became Ashik e Khaja. Ashik e Haus, Ashik e Mahdum e Paak. Why? Because Allah Hadrat taught love all those who love Muhammad Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa Love all those who love Muhammad Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa You know you talk about Allah Hadrat. There's so much we can say about Allah Hadrat's ilm. His knowledge, his wisdom, wisdom his, his taqwa. People tell me, Malana, what about Allah Hadrat's karamat? What about Allah Hadrat's karamat? I told him that all these people sitting in the masjid are Allah Hadrat's karamat. <laughs> All these people are Allah Hadrat's karamat. Jitne Sunni Allah Hadrat ki baad huye ya sab Allah Hadrat ki karamat hai. 
They are all Allah Hadrat's karamat. Because this was the karamat of Allah Hadrat. That when people were saying, Khaja is not existing. When people were saying, Baba Farid Dutin kuch hai nahi. Sab ko kaha ke hai, 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 yakinan hai. He is and they are. And through that, he brought us in the path of the true ahl sunnat So hum sab Allah Hadrat ki karamat hai. We are all the karamat of Allah Hadrat Adimul Barkat. Radi Allahu ta'ala an. Ana Hadrat Adimul Barkat's ilm if you want to talk about and Allah Akbar I told you on that night of the Urs of Allah Hadrat eight hours at Dawlatul Makkiyah Bil Maddatil Ghaibiyah in the Arabic language so Sal Guzar Gaya Aaj Tak Uski Ek Alif Ka Koi Jawab Nahi De Saka Leave the Kitab the Alif of at Dawlatul Makkiyah they are not able to answer what he wrote on the Ilm Ghaib of Rasulullah Sallallahu Ta'ala Alaihi Wasallam Allah Hazrat Radiallahu's knowledge was such that leave alone the ulama and the fuqaha and the muhaddisin and the mufakkirin. The modern scholars of the time till today are praising the work of Allah Hazrat. The mathematicians and the astronomers are looking into the works of Allah Hazrat Radiallahu. Professor Dr. Ziauddin Ahmad, when he came in the court of Allah Hazrat with a mathematical problem that could not be solved, he needed to go to Germany to solve it. He could not solve it. But he was guided, go to Bareli. He said, what will I get from a man who sits on a broken mat? What will I get from a man who did not see outside the four walls of his city? All the best in this field cannot resolve this problem. They cannot give the solution to this problem. What am I going to go? He was said by Hadrat Maulana Sulaiman Ashraf Sahib, you, you're going to go Germany so far, so big journey by ship. Bareli to ja ke ek bar to dek lo. Go one time at least. I'm being brief. After much pressure, he said, okay, what harm in going? Let me go, at least I'll prove these people wrong. That you can't just get this knowledge anywhere. He comes to Bareli Sharif, he meets Allah Hadrat in brief. It's about the time for Salah to happen. Allah Hadrat is walking towards the masjid. Walking with Allah Hadrat, he starts presenting his problems. Allah Hadrat says, what problem do you have? What's the problem that you can't find a solution? So he presents and asks the formulae. Allah Hadrat before reaches the masjid answers half his questions. Germany Jana Parahata. As about to enter the masjid, he asked another main and the final question. Allah Hadrat says, now later, because now we're going to enter the house of Allah. Yaha dunya ki baat nahi hoti hai. Now we're going to enter the house of Allah. Think of it, how many of us sit in the house of Allah and make gapshap? Azan is going, talking about business. Azan is going, shouting at each other. Azan is going, worldly discussion. Have you not heard that if you talk during the time of Azan and make it habitual, there's a fear at the time of death you will die without Iman. There's a fear of that. There's a risk of that. But look at Allah Hadrat's caution. Look at his taqwa. Look at his parhezgari. And when he returned and when he presented experiments in front of Dr. Sir Ziauddin and presented answers to Dr. Ziauddin's question on fractions etc., what happened? Dr. Sir Ziauddin said, Today I realized that there is something called Ilm al Today I realized that there is something called inspired knowledge. He said, It is impossible that he studied all this by somebody. This is inspired from the court of Allah. Huh? This is Allah Hadrat Adimul Barkat. Allah Hadrat was a mathematician. He was, a, he, was his, he was, you name it, he was a geomorphologist. You name the topic. Allah Hadrat has written on it. When Albert Porter wrote, Allah Hadrat may run of Albert Porter openly. The theory of Einstein, Allah Hadrat may run of it. Look at the works of Allah Hadrat. Look at Fozem Mubin. Look at all the other works of Allah Hadrat, the scientific works. You will be amazed at the knowledge that this Imam possessed. Today you want to look in encyclopedias. That Imam was a walking, talking, talking encyclopedia. That all the encyclopedias of modern day put into him would still not be able to fulfill what he knew. This was, what was this? When Allah Hadrat was asked, always that, where did you get all this? He said, this is all the karam from my sarkar. This is all the karam of Muhammad Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. But you know, with all Allah Hadrat's degrees, Allah Hadrat's degrees, meaning Allah Hadrat didn't go to any university and get all these degrees. With all his special capabilities, the highest degree that Allah Hadrat got was that of being the ashik azar. That ashik of rasul Pak, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, that when his lips moved, it was for the pleasure of Allah and his Rasul Sallallahu It was not to make dirham and dinar. Sadly today many, when we speak and we say we want for this, for loose, 
Everything is about fulus. When it came to Allah Hadrat, it wasn't fulus, it was khulus. It wasn't about money. It wasn't about money. Karumad ha ahle dawal raza. Par is bala me meri bala. Me gada hu apne kareem tha. If I'm a beggar, I'm a beggar in the court of my master, my generous master, Muhammad Rasulullah. Because you know who my master is? Allah tells, do you know who my master is? Kareem Aisa Mila ki jiske khule hai haat aur bade khazane. Subhanallah. Such a Kareem, such a great master that I've been blessed by the court of Allah. Ke Kareem apne karam ka sadka. Laeem be kadr ko na sharma. To aur raza se hisab lena. Raza bhi koi hisab me hai. And what a Kareem, what a generous master. Ke wah. Kya judo karam e shahe batha tera. Nahi sunta hi nahi. Mangane wala tera. And when the banda asks, and when the banda asks, to mere kareem se gar katra kisi ne manga. And when you ask from your master sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, you ask one drop from him. Are you asking from the Nabi and you asking one drop? Allah Allah. Allah Allah. Allah Allah. You asking from the Nabi? And you asking for one drop. Are you to kareem hai? Allah had for mate ki mere kareem se gar katra kisi ne manga. If somebody asks for a drop from my generous master sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, darya bahad ye hai. Darya bahad ye hai. You ask for a drop, he caused oceans to flow. Hadrat ya Sayyidina Abu Huraira, Sahabi Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, Ya Rasulallah, my memory is weak. I listen to you, but I don't remember. Nabi Kareem sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, what he asked for? He asked Nabi Kareem sallallahu alayhi wa sallam just to say, Ki my memory is weak. Mere Kareem se katra kisi ne manga. He only said, my memory is weak. Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Abu Huraira, daman phelao. Oh, Abu Huraira, open your shawl, open your chadar. Aaj kam koi vahabra hota. To kehde ke, he is asking for memory. Nabi is saying, open your sheet. Open your, your, your mantle, open your cloak, open your robe. What are you going to do with the cloak? What are you going to do with the robe? But remember, this was not Wahhabi, this was Sahabi. This was Sahabi. This was Abu Huraira radiallahu an. He's saying, Ya Rasulullah, memory is weak. Mere Kareem se gar katra kisi ne manga. He didn't say, Ya Rasulullah, give me anything. He didn't say anything. He said, Ya Rasulullah, memory is weak. Nabi Kareem sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Abu Huraira, open your dhamma. In the... قال قلت يا رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم إني أسمع منك حديثا كثيرا أنساه يا رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم I listen to hadith from you but I forget قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم أبسط رداك سبحان الله سبحان الله نبي صلى الله عليه وسلم said oh Abu Huraira open your rida open your chadar حضرت أبو هريرا opened his chadar and when حضرت أبو هريرا opened his chadar نبي كريم صلى الله عليه وسلم took his two مبارك hands like this you heard this many times but because I said the share, I'm explaining. Subhanallah. Haan, aur ye baad bar bar bole to iman aur mazboot hota hai. Aur iman mazboot hota hai. Took his empty hands visibly in the eyes of the world. Took his mubarak hands and he put it like this. In the chadar. Again he put his mubarak hand like this. Put it in the chadar. Again he put his mubarak hand like this. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam put it in the chadar. Ub sutri daqa fa basattu. ثُمَّ قَالَ ذُمَّهُ Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam then said, Oh Abu Huraira, gather it. Sine se laga lo. Abu Huraira says, For the mom to who? When the Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, gather it. I gathered it and Hadrat Sayyidi Muhaddis Kabir explains it very beautifully. Very beautifully. He says when Rasul Ipaq said, gather the chadar, it was an open chadar. Open chadar. Open chadar. I'm showing you. Open chadar. Ab me dekhata hu isi se. Open chadar. Hadrat Abu Huraira didn't do this. He didn't do this. You know what he did? He did this. He did this. He did this. This is what he did. Picked it from four sides. Why? Because when there's something in a chadar very heavy and you want to pick it, you pick it from four sides so you don't drop anything. He picked it like that and then he put it to his He picked it like that and Sahabi Rasul. He picked it like that and then he put it to his chest. And after he put it to his chest, after Hadrat Abu Huraira radiallahu put it to his chest, Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is 
in the, he's in the darbar of the Nabi. The Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is being told, Ya Rasulullah, I can't remember. Mere Karim Segar Katra Kisime Manga. Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is telling him that Abu Huraira, put your chadar, he puts the chadar. The Nabi says, gather it, he gathers it. Puts it to his chest and after he puts it to his chest, what does he say? What does he say? Oman Nasitu Shaykh Ba'd. After that, never did I forget anything Shay'an. Never did I forget anything in my life. Not did I not forget any hadith. I didn't forget anything. And open any kitab today. An Abi Huraira Ta radiallahu anh. An Abi Huraira Ta radiallahu anh. An Abi Huraira Ta radiallahu anh. Nobody has narrated so many hadith like Hazrat Abu Huraira radiallahu anh. What was this? What was this? What was this? Mere kareem se gar katra kisi ne manga darya baha diye hai. He asked for a drop. The Nabi gave him oceans. Nabi gave him oceans. And not only the oceans of hadith. The oceans of that knowledge which you and I will never even be able to go near. Mere kareem se gar katra kisi ne manga darya baha diye hai. Darya baha diye hai. When the... Look at subhanallah, subhanallah. Look, shairi ki baat karte. Allah ki shairi pe kurban jaye. The shairi is ishke rasool. Mere kareem. When somebody asked my generous master... For a drop, what's drop? Water. Water, ne? Fluid. Look at the shairi. Mere kareem se gar katra kisi ne manga dariya. He asked for water. He gave ocean. Allah is still connecting the word water. But look at ishk in it. Mere kareem se gar katra kisi ne manga dariya bahad ye hai. Flow. The word? Flow. So if you asked for a drop, my master gave you oceans, then made it flow. Darya baha diye hai. Baha means to flow. Baha has many meanings. One meaning is, if I say baha, then it means to flow. But if I say be baha, another meaning of baha is valuable. Be baha. Valuable. Okay? So Allah says, look at how he's shairi, but his love of Rasul in it. He says, mere kareem segar water. Let's keep this in mind. One drop. Katra kisini manga. Darya baha diye. Oceans to flow. Flow or dur. You know what's a dur? A pearl. Subhanallah, subhanallah. Where you find the pearl? In the ocean. Subhanallah. Mere kareem se gar katra. He started with the katra. Mere kareem se gar katra kisi ne manga darya baha diye hai. He caused oceans to flow. And oh Abu Huraira, not only oceans, dur be baha diye hai. He didn't only give you the oceans. He gave you the pearls that are in the oceans also. And why is the pearl? Where is the pearl? It's found at the bottom. On the on the on the on the on the on the low portion on the on the on the zameen of the ocean, Allah Hadrat Adim on the bed of the ocean, Allah Hadrat Adimul Barakat Allah is saying, Abu Huraira, you asked for a drop, he gave you the ocean, but he didn't only give you the ocean, he gave you the dur, he gave you the pearls also. This is the shan of the Nabi. You ask for a drop, he gives you oceans, not the oceans, he gives you the pearls which you never even thought about before. This is the shan of my Nabi sallallahu ta'ala alayhi wa sallam. Why? Because this is that Nabi that everything follows his ishara. This is that Nabi that everything follows his ishara. Chamak tut se paate he sab paane wale mera dil bhi chamka de. Chamkaane wale I was going to speak on that abbaat hi nahi hua aayi us tak. Chamak tut se paate he sab paane wale mera dil bhi chamka de. Chamkaane wale let me tell you I've said this before this share is a wazifa. You got heart problem? Anybody got heart problem? Blocked artery? Dawa to khau thik hai dua dawa dono karo. Every day after namaz, put your hand on your heart and read three times. Chamak tut se paate hai sab paane wale. Mera dil bhi dam chamka de chamkaane wale. Got blood pressure. Heart gets ghabra. Paro or dekho. Magar parna isa chahiye ki dil se paro. Dil se paro. Kyunke nahi sunta hi nahi mangane wala tera. Nahi sunta hi nahi mangane wala tera. I am talking from experience. I am talking from personal experience. Mein khud parta alhamdulillah. After every namaz. Or maine khud iska fark dekha hai maine khud aazmaya hai i have seen it myself chamak tujhse paate hai sab paane wale mera dil bhi chamka de chamkhane wale and this is that nabi subhanallah i'm going to end with this today this is that nabi sallallahu alaihi wasallam concerning whom ala hadrat adimul barakat radiyallahu ta'ala beautifully says what does he say what hafsa was reading ishare se chaam cheer diya with one gesture by picking his finger you know what the word cheer means? To tear apart. He split apart the moon. Ishare se chand cheer diya. Chupe huwe khur ko diya. The sun that already was hidden, he brought it back. 
گئے ہوئے دن دا ڈے دیٹ آٹ آلریڈی گون ایٹ مغرب دا ڈے از گون نیو ڈے اسٹارٹس ایو اسٹارٹس گئے ہوئے دن کو آسر کیا دیٹ ڈے دیٹ ایٹ گون ای میڈ اٹ آسر اگین فار ہو فار مولا علی رضی اللہ تعالیٰ گئے ہوئے دن کو آسر کیا یہ تاب و تباہ تمہارے لیے اینڈ ایز آئی سیٹ بفور اینڈ آئی مینڈنگ ود دس ان شاء اللہ العظیم سبحان اللہ قربان جائے پیپل تھنک اینڈ اسٹارٹ ٹو آس بٹ ہاؤ دا نبی بروت دا اسپلٹ دا مون ان ٹو ہاؤ ود ون اشارہ اسپلٹ دا مون ان ٹو نبی پوائنٹ از فنگر دس مون اسپلٹ ان ٹو دا دا مون اسپلٹ بیکاز دا نبی پوائنٹ از فنگر اور دا مون جسٹ اسپلٹ لانگ ڈسکشن یس اسپلٹ بیکاز ہی پوائنٹ از فنگر مبارک بٹ دا مون واز ویٹنگ کہ نبی اشارہ کب کرے تو میں اپنا سینا کو پھاڑ دوں مون واز ویٹنگ دا مون واز ویٹنگ کہ مصطفیٰ کب اشارہ کرے تو میں اپنے سینا کو چھیر دوں اور دکھا دو کہ میں بھی عاشق رسول دکھا دو کہ میں بھی عاشق رسول ارے یہ چاند سورت ستارے سب عاشق رسول میں جدر کہتا ہوں ادھر جانا میں جدھر کہتا ہوں ادھر جانا کیونکہ ایک دن وہ آئے گا کہ جب میں اشارہ کروں گا تو دو حصے میں ہونا پڑے گا حضور واس ٹریننگ دا مون فرام دین یہ سب سمجھنے کی بات ہے یو نو وے یو لرن فرام دیس تھنگس ناٹ فرام بکس ناٹ فرام بکس یو لرن اٹ ایٹ دا فیٹ آف دا پائس یو لرن اٹ فرام نس بٹ ٹو دا پائس دوز تھنگس یو لرن فرام دا بک ادے بٹ بیونڈ دا بک دا بک از دا اوشن وی وانٹ ٹو گیٹ دا پرس دا اسپریچل پرس اٹیچ یور سیلف ٹو دا پائس دل میں خود باتیں آنے لگی گی سمجھنے لگی گی اللہ تعالیٰ کی واسٹ فرینتھ ان ایمان ٹرو لو فور ہیم این از بلا و رسول صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم اللہ کی پاس ایمان لیٹ اس لیو دس ولد ایمان اسپیشل دعا فور زاہد بھائی زاہد شیخ فیمس زاہد پلما ہاں یس ٹو پلمز ہی بلیو زاہد بھائی ہیڈ اے اسٹروک فیو ڈیز بیک یگ پرسن اللہ تعالیٰ ان کو شفا کامل صحت ہے عاجل عطا فرمائے اللہ میک ہی ویل اینڈ وی میک اسپیشل دو آلسو فار آل دوز ادرز ہو ان آور کمیونٹی دوز دیر پاس وین احل سنا لائک زول ٹیمپ حضرت مولانا قاسم قادری فرام ناٹنگ ہیم ان دا یو کے ہی میس میز دی میسج می دس مارننگ ہیز فادر پاس اوے آلسو سو میک دو آف ہز فادر از ویل اللہ تعالیٰ ایک زول ٹیم ان جنت الفردوس آل دا ادرز دیر پاس وین احل سنا اللہ ایک زول دیم جنت الفردوس اللہ پروٹیکٹ آل آور مسلیز اینڈ آل دا سنی سی اللہ کی دا مسلمز ان دا ورلڈ فرام ایوری بلا ایوری وبا ایوری آفت ایوری مصیبت اللہ کی برکت ان رشک حلال اللہ کی پاس ادیمان لیٹ اس لیو دس ورلڈ ادیمان وما علینہ البلاغ السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ